Hey everyone, so as you may or may not have heard, there's been a bit of a hoo-ha about my Ether wallet. There have been claims that it, it's, um, it's been exposed, etc. My Ether wallet have come out and said that's not true. Um, and for those of you, of you who are already familiar with uh, my Ether wallet, um, when you come to access your your wallet, uh, you'll probably see this now. Where if you want to put the, the the key store file in, or put your private key in, or however you want to basically access it, it's saying this is not the recommended way to do it because what they are worried is that you are not actually accessing the proper my Ether wallet. Uh, site. So what it could be is a, a, a cloned, scammed site. You simply then hand over your key store uh, and then hand over your, your secret phrase or even your private key, etc. So that's what they're worried. So what we need to do is take this completely offline. So uh, this video, is, I'm going to show you how to create um, a, a Ether wallet completely offline that's never seen the the internet so basically this was actually on uh, my Ether wallet's main website and it, it simply walks you through the whole process um, so I'm just gonna uh, just show you because uh, it it could be a little bit tricky so basically uh, you need to download the, the actual my Ether wallet website so we can do it here so it basically takes you to um, the github and you need to download this Ether Wallet uh, version 3 here. So you click that, it'll then start downloading. And I'm just going to drag this over to my desktop. And here we go. So here we go. So I've just dragged it over to the desktop. Um, as you can see, it's a zip file. So what I'm actually going to do is. Um, drag that over to the desktop we don't need this anymore and I'm just going to call this uh, off line my Ether wallet now what you could do is then uh, put this on a USB um, and then transfer this over to um, a laptop or a computer that's never ever been connected to the internet now I know the security buffs here are going well actually you're then compromising that computer by putting a USB stick in but again we, we don't need to go to the, the ends of the world with this um, maybe when you have sort of eight figures that that's something to be worried about but for the moment um, yeah you don't you don't need to worry so you can either take this to an air gapped computer or you can just turn off the internet. Um, it, it depends how paranoid you are, really. Um, everyone's on a, on a different scale. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I've turned off the internet here. And uh, what you can then do, once you open this up, you then click the index file here, or double click, and it opens up. So for me, it uses Chrome, but we are completely offline. As you can see, it's just running the website off of this, this file. Uh, it then goes through the normal things. You can just click out of it. And there you go. You can now create a, a, a My Ether Wallet wallet completely offline. So let's just uh, put in a password. I love Neo123. Create wallet, new wallet. You can then download the key store file. So it's pretty much instant. And let's drag that to the desktop as well. Um, I understand continue you then have your private key and you can then save that however you wish I'm not going to bother in this example and um, yeah there we go so it's completely completely uh, done so let's quickly access this so you can either do it via the, this tab here or this tab here um, but yeah I, I, I just normally go to this one here so you can then go to the key store. I know it says it's not recommended, but we, as as you can see, we are still offline. Um, so yeah, select wallet file. So this is going to be the key store file there, and put the password in. I love Neo one two three. Unlock. So there you go, and here we have we are you are in your wallet completely offline, and this is your address. 
So you can now send any ERC20 token, any uh, like, like Ether or Tron or anything, anything like that you want uh, directly to this address, which is completely offline. It's never seen the internet. Um, jobs are good. So that's how to create and access your My Ether Wallet offline. Uh, what we're going to do now is, in the next video, show you how to s generate and send transactions uh, offline. So uh, I'll see you in the next video.